All right, I have a recipe question for you. Ready? Great. What happens when you mix calm focus, Hyderabadi biryani, and an IITN brother for inspiration? I'll tell you. You get a JEE champion who secured an All India Rank 74 in JEE Advanced 2025. Meet our next problem solver, Dhanush Reddy. Hi, Dhanush. Hi. Congratulations. Thank you. How are you feeling? I'm feeling really proud and I'm happy that I deserve what I get. I got what I deserve. That's fantastic to know. Tell us a little bit about your family. How did they support you in this journey? Especially your brother. Like uh, my brother was an IITN and he inspired me a lot. Like uh, he said, uh, how is the life at IIT and kept on motivated me. My father was also a physics teacher ago. He also like said, uh, what is the life in IIT and he helped me. That, that also inspired you. Okay. So apart from studies and academics, what else are your interests? We've, we've heard that you're a big time foodie. Is that right information? Yes, ma'am. What are your favorite cuisines? Like, uh, my favorite is Hyderabadi style and South Indian style. <laughs> okay. Is Hyderabadi biryani one of your favorite dishes? Yeah, yes, ma'am. Okay. That's nice. You joined Akash in class 10th, right? Yes, so, uh, starting coaching at that early age, how did that shape your journey? Like, uh, it will help in 11th and 12th, we will have good basics of all chapters. Mm -hmm. And it will help, it will give a head start uh, uh, of others. And we will feel like a little more confident in mm -hmm. others. Mm -hmm. okay. If you have a, a head start. Okay. Uh, let's uh, talk a little bit about your preparation strategy. How did you pre prepare for mains and advanced? Was there something different or did you follow a same pattern? Like uh, for mains, it's more about time. We need to solve all questions in less time. And advanced, it's like about thinking. We get more time for a single question. So for advanced, we should be more focused and uh, more deep in the concepts. Okay. And how about the last few months of your preparation? They would be slightly different from mm. the other long preparation that you were doing, right? Last few months, I was uh, mainly focused in giving only exams. Like, uh, I would find out my errors by giving more exams and I would try to rectify it. I mostly focused on my weak subject, which is chemistry. Okay. So, you knew that that's a place where you had to put more effort. Okay. How, uh, what motivated you or what encouraged you to have a positive mindset all through this journey? Like, uh, there will be many up and downs in this journey. But uh, we, must, we must not be overconfident when we are up and we must not be underconfident when we are on close. Like marks will keep on fluctuating, but we should maintain the confidence and motivation. If you had to describe your experience at Akash in three words, what would you say? Like it was excellent, excellent amazing. Amazing. Very enjoyable. And enjoyable. Oh, mm. that is beautiful. That is beautiful. Okay. One advice that you would give to the future GE aspirants? Like uh, my main advice would be don't leave your weak concepts like uh, any weak subject, you should not be like focusing on your strong area rather like we should be focusing on weak area. If the paper, the final paper will contain most of the weak area questions, we would be lagging in the paper. So focus on all areas, like keep, be motivated always and believe in yourself. Okay, that's nice. One last question I have for you Dhanush is how important is it for a person to take small breaks in between the long hours of study? Like breaks are very much required because if we study non-stop for many hours, it wouldn't be digest and would, it wouldn't be much effective. So taking break and talking with your friends or taking a nap would be better. That's very nice. Thank you so much and congratulations once again. Thank you. Dhanush's story tells us that it is okay to have downtime. You can take it, you can enjoy it, you can take mental breaks, talk to people and still make it big. But you have to remain focused and you have to remain motivated. Uh, so every aspirant out there, do remember to breathe, believe, stay grounded and success is just another chapter away.